If you play with butlers in The Sims 2, you probably know that if a burglar comes onto the lot to break into your house, the butler will call the police. But what you might not know is that if the burglar wanders onto the lot just to visit, perhaps because they're even friends with the owner of the house, the butler will still call the police. <laughs> At this point, you may be wondering, what if a burglar hired a butler for their own house? Yes, even then. But what if the burglar had died, and was now a ghost? Even ghost burglars can't rest in peace. Legend says that the very first butler in the Sims world, Alfred, was working for a very wealthy family. When late one night, while everyone was asleep, he heard that Being unable to call the police himself, he simply had no option but to stand around <coughs> screaming. <coughs> After that, poor Alfred was never the same. He went on to create the prestigious Sims Guild of Butlers, where all Sims butlers are hired from and trained to be vigilant against any and all burglars. Or it's just a weird oversight slash bug the developers didn't notice while testing. I think both of these explanations make perfect sense. 
So this video was inspired by something I read on the Sims wiki which said that even if a burglar is resurrected on a lot, the butler will still call the police. Which made me immediately wonder, what if the burglar was a ghost? And I really thought that was going to be the line where they would stop calling the police, but it wasn't, which is really great. I mean, it's not great if you want to play a burglar and a butler in the same household, but it's pretty amusing to me since this has never impacted my regular gameplay. So I basically consider this some kind of weird lore now. But if you do want to play with butlers and burglars in the same household without these crazy shenanigans going on, there is a mod that will stop this from happening and I've included a link to that in the description below. So I wrote the script with Alfred to be kind of a silly joke, but then afterwards I read something weird on the Sims wiki about burglars in The Sims 1. So a lot of people have spoken about how the sound effects in The Sims 1 are scarier sounding than in later games, which is definitely true. And the burglar sound effect is definitely one of those themes that is at its most chilling in the first game. But it's not just the sound effects that are less frightening in later games. In The Sims 1, burglars won't just steal an entire hot tub, which in itself is somewhat defying the laws of physics. Seriously, how are they fitting a hot tub into that bag? No, in The Sims 1, the burglar will occasionally steal babies. Well, at least hypothetically, because on The Sims wiki page for The Sims 1 Burglar, it's mentioned that the burglar will occasionally steal babies. But I tried tons of times with the complete collection and couldn't get it to work. I even downloaded a custom content computer that would summon the burglar instantly, which I tragically only discovered some time after testing this. Initially I was just trying it the old fashioned way where I'd wait for the burglar to show up. So after I couldn't make it happen with that version of The Sims 1, I uninstalled the game and reinstalled only the base game, which was completely unpatched. We're talking the pre-Rosebud Monichi era where you have to type in Cloud Palsius. I'm probably saying that wrong. The burglar doesn't even have a name in this version of the game if you hover over them, usually it's some sneaky sim. And still, no matter what, they wouldn't steal the baby. At one point, I even blocked the pedestrian portal and placed the baby right next to them, but still, no luck. To be fair, at that point, I think they were already determined to leave. So unfortunately, I couldn't get footage of this, and so I'm really curious if anyone watching this has actually had this happen in their game. I did search a little online, and I found a forum post where someone was talking about this happening to them in their game way back in 2003. But there were no screenshots or anything, so I've not seen any visual evidence of this happening. I think it could make sense as a bug though, because as far as I know the babies in The Sims 1 are objects, so it's possible that very rarely, in some version of the game, maybe there was a bug where the burglar steals babies. But there are actually a bunch of objects that the burglars don't seem to steal, like they would never steal tables for some reason when I was testing it. I would have thought if they stopped the burglars from stealing tables, they would have prevented them from stealing babies. But I'm really curious if this is actually possible, so if you have had a burglar steal a baby from your game, let me know in the comments. If it is true, then The Sims 1 burglar music is actually kind of fitting, because the burglars in later games will only steal objects on the lot. They won't abduct actual sims. So that's pretty dark. Although it's probably just a bug. There were a lot of video game myths around back in the day, like the Mew Under the Truck urban legend in Pokemon that everyone used to talk about when I was a kid. So I'm not saying this didn't happen, but sometimes people did invent stories, and this one has a certain creepy pasta quality to it. But I do think it's more plausible than some things I've heard, and the Sims series has way weirder glitches anyway. <laughs> For some weird reason, my camera just got hijacked, there's no one in the house. There's a staircase going up here, and I can't see... I can't see what's happening. It, whatever's happening must be happening upstairs. I think he's on fire. I don't know why the camera decided to move me over here, because I don't know this sim. <laughs> Hurry up! We have to save this sim! What is that? Wait, what? Who's that? Who's just run in? Where did they go? Oh! 
<laughs> I don't know what is happening. Uh, I think they're definitely on fire, right? But it's just all of the sims are invisible. They haven't loaded in. Oh, there we go. What was that about? So yeah, if you've experienced this bug in your game, let me know in the comments. Or actually, since it's almost Halloween, let me know the spookiest glitch you've experienced in a Sims game. I've gotten comments on some of my videos in the past where people have talked about uh, strange glitches they've experienced in their game, and some of them are really great.